Russia's annexation of Crimea is a done deal. Friday, Russia's upper house of parliament unanimously approved the ratification of a treaty to formally join Crimea with Russia. During a ceremony at the Kremlin, President Vladimir Putin signed the treaty into law. The same day, hours after announcing more sanctions, the European Union signed a political association agreement with Ukraine as a show of support to Kiev's newly installed government. If you remember, it was the decision of Ukraine's ex-president Viktor Yanukovych to ditch an agreement with the EU back in November that kicked off the protests in Kiev. Instead, Yanukovych had opted for a bailout package from Russia. Which brings us to today. Russia maintains its annexation of Crimea is legal, while the U.S. and its European allies say Russia is violating international law. On Thursday, President Obama imposed a new round of sanctions on 20 members of Putin's inner circle. Almost immediately, Russia responded with its own sanctions against U.S. officials. Senator John McCain, whose name was on the list, laughed it off, tweeting, I guess this means my spring break in Siberia is off. Wall Street didn't seem to mind either, with stocks trading higher after the news. Russian stocks, on the other hand, dipped sharply. For Newsy, I'm Elizabeth Hagedorn, multiple sources of broader view.